I'm gonna show you my favorite PDF note-taking app for Windows and explain some important features that will convince you. Hi, my name is David and I'm a third year medical student in Switzerland. Drawboard PDF is a multifunctional PDF note-taking app for Windows. You can download it for $10 on your Surface Pro or any other device that has Windows on it. And trust me, this money really is nothing compared to all the benefits you gain from this app. Where do I use this app? I personally use it for every lecture in medical school because it provides all the functions and features I need for the various classes like anatomy or physiology. But you can also use this software in meetings with co-workers of your company as it allows you to write down some additional things as you're speaking. The good thing is it keeps your notes for future usages without having to save the PDF. So let's talk about functions and features. First, I want to talk about the touch control and how good this program supports the pen device. As you can see, the app supports any cheap pen perfectly. I use a China-made $20 pen and it works really good. So you actually don't need an expensive pen for a productive note-taking time. Any other device writes perfectly as well. The next really nice thing about this app, and this is my favorite, is document manipulation. What do I mean by that? It's really easy to delete pages or add any number of blank pages to your PDF document. And you can turn your pages horizontally and vertically. You can also add images which, and I really like that, can be photographed with the app itself. So for example, if the professor draws something on his PowerPoint presentation, you can easily photograph it and add it to your notes. There are multiple pen variants and colors. You can highlight things and underline them or add objects, at, for example, as bullet points. One thing that bothers me sometimes is the slow loading time when you open a large PDF or when you open many documents at once. But I suppose this problem occurs in every note taking app. So we're coming to an end. If I could help you, then please click the like button. Also subscribe to this channel for more videos. Bye.